so subscriptions versus buying the music. What do you think will, right now, obviously, buying music is the dominant paradigm. Yeah. Five years from now, subscriptions will be the dominant paradigm or downloading? What do you think? Yeah, five, five is always the hard one to call. Yeah, that's what uh, I mean. You know, I think subscriptions... 25, you can answer it easier. Yeah. <laughs> You know, you, 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 have a, you have a tough problem in that the peak music buying generation uh, got used to Napster and couldn't buy digital music. So, you know, got out of the habit of, I mean, everybody in college would borrow somebody else's CD and copy it on a tape or in my sure. age, uh, or, you know, collect, collect it off of Napster or, or yeah, any of the services. Um, but you'd get out of college and you'd, you know, you'd buy it everything and so you'd have volumes of CDs or albums or whatever uh, and that generation got missed and it's not like the music industry is going to have a um, you know if you have a hundred thousand tracks we'll give you a one-time discount on that right uh, so how do, you, how do you bring that group back in that has this taste for you know just a massive volume of music eat. yeah and the only way I see to do that is subscriptions but right. subscriptions have been usability challenges and so if you make, you know, on a portable player, nobody's really nailed the subscription model yet. Um, there have been a bunch of tries at it, but sure. you get on an airplane and, you know, your music timed out. Well, that sucks. That's not going to work, yeah. right? Um, so I think for purchase made a lot of sense because the portable music, a la the iPod, you know, is the largest market. But I think as connected iPods and I, a la an iTouch or an iPhone um, happen. And in the home, subscriptions make total sense. In the US, I think probably two thirds of our customers use at least one subscription service. So that tells you how. Wow. Well, I mean, these are also people who are blowing it out with a couple of thousand dollar system. Yeah, but, but you know, music in the home is a social thing. You have a dinner yeah. party, you have a you sure. know, bachelor party, uh, whatever have you. It wasn't my party. <laughs> And, but I mean, be clear inevitably, someone's going to walk in and say, hey, do you have this Radiohead yes, track? And sure. you're just going to want to play it. You've been watching This Week in Startups. To watch the full episode, click here. To check out some other shows from This Week in, click here.